In the heart of Southeast Asia, where tropical rains mingle with the vibrant pulse of bustling fruit markets. There exists a fruit hailed as the king of fruits. This is durian, a culinary icon celebrated for its rich, bold flavor yet polarizing due to its pungent aroma, captivating some while repelling others. Durian is more than a gift of nature, it's an economic treasure, generating billions of dollars annually. Join us on a journey to explore durian. From lush farms, through the meticulous care of farmers, to cutting edge processing lines and the dining tables of millions worldwide. Durian, belonging to the Durio genus, traces its origins to the Malay archipelago with its earliest roots in Borneo and Sumatra. The species Durio zibethinus, commonly known as durian, is the only type widely traded on the global market. Southeast Asia, particularly Thailand, Malaysia, Indonesia, and Vietnam, is the cradle of durian, home to hundreds of varieties, each with unique traits. Thailand boasts over 300 varieties from Moan Thong or Golden Pillow, with large, sweet, mildly scented flesh, to the premium knot durian from Nantaburi, where the prized Kenya variety can fetch up to $530 for a 5.5 pound fruit. Malaysia, with around 100 varieties, is renowned for Musong King, also known as Mao Shan Wang, dubbed the King of Kings for its golden, creamy flesh with a complex sweet bitter taste. Indonesia contributes diverse local varieties, while Vietnam, Cambodia, and the Philippines are steadily carving out their place in the durian industry. Durian's allure lies not only in its flavor, but also in its immense economic value. Thailand leads the world with a production exceeding 1.43 million tons in 2023, concentrated during the harvest season from May to August, creating a lively atmosphere at fruit markets in Chanthaburi, Thailand's tropical fruit bowl. The Mon Thong variety, Thailand's most commercially sought after produces large, elongated, oval-shaped fruits tapering at the stalk with distinctive yellowish-brown rinds. Each fruit, weighing about 4.4 to 13.2 pounds, has a thick, moderately long stalk and a rind covered in sharp, densely packed spines. A single fruit contains 10 to 15 sections with small, shriveled seeds and each section typically holds three small, thick, creamy, pale yellow segments with a mild aroma and excellent quality. Malaysia follows with over 187,800 acres of durian plantations, with 65 to 70 percent of its Musong King variety produced in Pahang. Musong King fruits are symmetrically oval, 
slightly rounded at the top, with sparse spines, a large, short stalk, and vibrant saffron colored flesh that is smooth, sticky, and intensely creamy with a strong aroma. Meanwhile, Vietnam is emerging as a rising star, achieving a durian output of over 937,000 tons in 2023, solidifying its position on the global durian map with high quality varieties like Re6, Monthong, and hybrid durians, favored both domestically and internationally, especially in China. The global durian market, valued at over $15 billion, is projected to reach $25 billion by 2030, with Thailand, Malaysia, and Vietnam dominating exports, while China leads imports, accounting for 60 to 80% of global durian imports. A single Kenya durian from Nantaburi once sold at auction for $48,000, a testament to the fruit's economic allure. Producing high-quality durians requires meticulous preparation and scientific precision. Durian is a tropical crop, thriving at elevations below 2,625 feet, temperatures of 75 minus 86 degrees Fahrenheit, humidity of 75 to 80 percent, and well-drained soil with a pH of 5 to 6.5. Farmers begin by clearing land, using excavators to level terrain and create access roads for harvesting, particularly on sloped or hilly areas to prevent water logging, Durian's greatest foe. Modern drip irrigation systems are installed, delivering 1 to 1.6 gallons of water per tree daily, paired with drainage channels to protect roots during rainy seasons. Durian trees are typically propagated through grafting or cutting to preserve the mother tree's genetic traits, ensuring robust growth and fruiting as early as for two six years, compared to eight to ten years for seed-grown trees. During planting, Farmers dig small holes, mix soil with basic fertilizer, place the sapling, and carefully backfill to avoid root damage. Trees are usually spaced 20 to 40 feet apart to accommodate their deep roots and wide canopies. In not the bury, farmers opt for clean water over chow fray or river water for irrigation, believing it enhances fruit quality. Cost of care is significant. Water alone can cost up to $2,000 to $100 annually for a single farm. Caring for durian trees is an art that demands patience and precision. Starting at eight months, Farmers apply fertilizer every four months for the first three years. Pesticides are sprayed twice yearly to protect against pests, particularly Phytophthora disease. When trees flower, farmers prune excess flowers and immature fruits to channel nutrients to remaining fruits, ensuring large, thick flesh 
high quality yields. Durian flowers, bisexual and 1.2 to 2.8 inches long, form clusters of 10 to 45 on old branches or trunks, typically pollinated by bats, moths, or bees. Due to low self-pollination rates, farmers often hand pollinate at night, from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m., using pollen from different trees to maximize results. It takes about a month for durian flowers to develop from tiny buds to full blooms. Durians take three to six months to ripen, secured with ropes or nets to prevent falling, especially for fruits weighing up to 17 to 20 to pounds. Harvesting durian is an exhilarating yet skillful task. In Thailand and Vietnam, durians are often cut when nearly ripe for transport, as the fruit continues ripening after being picked and can be artificially ripened for markets if needed. Farmers check ripeness by tapping the husk for a distinct sound or observing the rind turning yellow brown. In Malaysia, the tradition of letting fruits fall naturally is preferred, with harvesting occurring twice daily during peak season. Each tree yields 30 to 50 fruits, and to prevent damage, farmers work in teams using burlap sacks to catch fruits or long poles with knives to cut stalks. Post-harvest, durians are washed to remove dust, latex, and debris, ensuring hygiene before market entry. Processing durian is a critical step to meet diverse consumer demands. At minor facilities like Chanthaburi Global Foods, skilled workers slice open each durian, extracting the fragrant, golden flesh. Durians are processed into fresh fruit, pulp, or freeze-dried products. Spiral and vacuum freeze-drying technologies preserve flavor texture, and nutrients, while storage at minus 31 degrees Fahrenheit ensures year-round freshness. Durians are vacuum-packed, using modified atmosphere packaging or vacuum skin packaging to protect them during international shipping. Durian-based products, such as ice cream, pastries, beverages, and even durian pizzas from brands like Pizza Hut and KFC, are gaining popularity contributing to Asia's $175 billion food market.
Durian's appeal extends beyond its unique taste to its status as a nutritional powerhouse. Rich in vitamin C and B6, potassium, and fiber, durian supports digestion, boosts immunity, and provides abundant energy. Its antioxidants and mood-enhancing compounds reduce stress, making it an ideal treat for relaxation. A 5.5-pound durian can supply over 30% of daily fiber needs, delivering a creamy, sweet flavor with notes of vanilla, caramel, and jackfruit, a culinary experience like no other. However, the durian industry faces numerous challenges. Climate change poses a significant threat, as the tropical climate essential for durian cultivation makes farms vulnerable to floods, storms, and extreme weather events, jeopardizing yields. Additionally, trade barriers, such as tariffs imposed by importing countries, complicate market access. Transporting durians is another hurdle due to their pungent aroma we think to bans in many airports and hotels. Despite these obstacles, with soaring demand, particularly from China, the durian industry continues to thrive. Festivals like Thailand's Chanthaburi Fruit Festival and Vietnam's Sai Mon Durian Festival in Ben Trade not only celebrate durian, but also serve as a bridge, bringing the king of fruits closer to consumers worldwide. The journey of durian is a tale of harmony between nature, humanity, and technology. From tiny saplings and verdant farms to refined products on international markets, durian is more than a fruit. It's a symbol of perseverance, innovation, and passion. Whether you embrace or shy away from its aroma, Durian's allure is undeniable, a tropical treasure conquering the world. Pick up a durian segment, savor its unique flavor, and immerse yourself in the remarkable story of the king of fruits. If you're passionate about exploring modern agriculture and food production, follow our channel for more engaging content in upcoming videos.